Hi, I'm Sharon Gadella from Seven News and Today Tonight Queensland. As a journalist, I guess I'm acutely aware of how troubled the world can be. There certainly can be more bad news than good news. And that's one of the main reasons why I'm very passionate about seeing the arts grow and develop in Queensland and helping to promote that. I think dance has the ability to move people, uh, to take them out of their normal lives into a, another place. And I never underestimate the power of dance or the power of art. The cultural, um, you know, arts aspect, uh, what really meant to me is I think arts is really the reflection of a society and uh, is, is the glue and the heart and soul of uh, how people feel, how people, um, you know, recognize the place and the society that they live in. So it plays a very important part in people's lives. My background in urban design, I'm really interested in arts and culture in, in the realm of city making and how it changes places. Um, I think it's really, I mean you see that in inner city Brisbane at the moment where um, redevelopment happened and they kept great buildings for arts and culture including this building that we're in at the moment. Um, so I'm, so I think to me it's um, a real expression of the community and the cities. I think we were created to create. Um, those, it's why we crave truth and, and goodness and beauty and uh, the arts are uniquely placed to, to express that. I think arts and culture is really important because it allows for kind of these transformative moments and those can relate to the individual kind of practitioner or could relate to an audience member or someone within a gallery. I don't think it's specific to a a genre or a discipline or an area in culture, but that it is this um, really important thing to the health of a, a society or a community that allows for us to speak about political things, personal things, emotional things, and um, to really look at the parts of ourselves that really I don't know if many other places in culture allow that. Art has the ability to um, bend cultural norms and evolve um, constructs that we uh, are familiar with. There's so much about arts and culture that inspires me. It inspires me by the way it makes me feel, by the way it makes me think, by the way it challenges the choices that I make every day. At times I think as a society we just need relief. We need a reason to, to smile, to laugh, to be entertained. And I think also the arts makes us question why we do things like we do. It challenges us, it makes us look at the world and think how can we do that better. And I think we're happier and we're richer as a result of having the arts in our life in, in all its forms. And if I can help promote that, then I'm more than happy to help. As a leader, practitioner uh, and uh, also enthusiast of art, uh, I, what I, all I want to do is really make a meaningful difference through dance through the group of talented artists that I lead to be able to create and present the best possible excellence on stage to be able to make a difference in people's lives. Perhaps make them cry, make them laugh, make them reflect, make them realize or make them appreciate of what uh, life has to offer. What sets Queensland apart is sort of these great regional networks and things happening outside of major cities. So, you know, that's really unique and interesting to me. I guess the big, the big um, arts and cultural wish for me would be um, a really big festival. Um, sort of being involved in community festivals with the URB Collective, but something just super major like um, the Venice Biennale, but of the Southern Hemisphere. So that was kind of my my dream. As a visual artist, uh, I'm charged with the responsibility of making something of, of what I see around me and sharing that with others. What brings me back here is like, it's almost like an incubator. It's a place um, because I've got that um, association with it to sort of um, consolidate ideas and um, kind of like to kind of rest in this like nice sort of familiarity and and from that, I'm able to like then stretch again and breathe again in a different way. We have such a thriving, vibrant and beautiful art scene in Brisbane. Every night you can go and see something that is going to inspire you and challenge you. 